I hope guys this is my fourth time recording this video. I won't go off topic this time because I for the two three times I've been going off topic of other topics. Okay. Um Google is gathering millions of personal health records with alleged product nightgale. Of course, you know, these people in California say, oh, it's just a conspiracy. You know, the push by, you know, the right, orange man, you know, these are the same people who, you know, this it conspiracy theory, you know. It's a conspiracy theory, um, according to the ad Democrat, you know, SAW. These, these guys are put it on and say, oh, it's a conspiracy theory, okay. Google secretly gathered millions of patent records across 21 states in an effort dubbed Project Nightgale. And you know what? YouTube's gonna delink this video because I'm criticizing Google because that's how YouTube is, okay? You know, YouTube is losing money for Google, and they, because, you know, they don't know how to run, you know, or anything, but we're not talking about that, um, that's a different article. The Wall Street Journal, neither doctors nor patients were made aware of the effort, and Google and it has both data in the program, includes lab results, doctor diagnosis, and hospitalization records, among other categories, and a complete health history, complete patient names, and data birth. And Google, it's not, it's not like, you know, it's different, it's not, and of course, some people can say, oh, you know, it's just, you know, people, you know, um, you know, they're not, they're not telling, they're not keeping it with Google, they're not, they're, no, Google is literally, you know, actually stealing public health records. This, so, but you know, Google is protected by the government, okay? Oh no, if Google is protected by the government, they're not going to be sued for this, okay? They're not, okay? Because... You know these companies, Google, Facebook, and Twitter are all protected by the government, okay? And of course, operates 21 states. Um, company has faith-based healthcare organization dedicated to transportation through innovation across care. Here in care, and according to the Wall Street Journal, Google is using data from the system to design software to tailor individual patient care by using artificial intelligence and machine learning. Yeah, the same machine learning that you know. Gets towels demonetized and deleted off of YouTube. Yeah, the same machine will worry that you know does it that will automatically demonetize your video. You have you know a certain mustache man in the video or, or any historical videos about World War Two demonetized. Okay, this is the same. This is the same box that will, that will delete channels for reused content and other things. Okay, or demonetize the channels. Oh, you have two of the same videos. Okay. The reused content, okay? You know, that's the whole thing of this thing. Forbes reports that part of the project extension of for patient data to Google's cloud servers. The idea was using the system assessing health providers could use a tool called patient search. So yes, Google. And of course, this has all good, this of course has all good attention, okay? Google is, wants to help people, okay? Wants to help nurses get, you know, better and doctors have better treatments for with patients, um, and focus on industry and basically in the lucrative healthcare space. Last year, Google hired a healthcare executive to oversee many health initiatives. But now the tech company, but that is not the thing. Google is, of course, you know, using its um, technology to help people, and that that's not a bad thing here. Okay, Google is, of course, being used of inappropriate access to the records of the people. That's the issue here, okay? This all stuff is all good world here, okay? Google's helping people is using their, um, technology, is giving people, their companies, their, their hospitals, their technology to, you know, help and to help, you know, healthcare, help doctors and stuff. That isn't the problem here, okay? AI assistant and stuff. Okay, that is, the problem is Google is stealing stuff, okay? And of course Google is going to get away with this because, you know, they're protected by the government, okay? People say, no, Google isn't protected by the government. You know, Google is not protected by the government, okay? You know, Google is not protected by the government, okay? Google government protections, okay? And I think it's federal protection because you know Google has federal protection. I think 
It's Google or um Twitter. Twitter has federal protection. And of course, Google and of course, you know, the rebels, you know, had to protect California. Protect the thing is, California that does this. Of course, if you find this on Google, you won't be able to find this at all because you know, Google's gonna hide it. You know, they're, they're gonna say, Oh, yeah, government is protecting us, <laughs> it's protecting Google, not protecting people, you know. Um, and of course, they're gonna say, Oh, we're open, we're open, we're open, okay? That's the excuse they use, okay? Um, and Yes, Google is stealing people's health records. No, Google, and basically up there has the health, and, and of course they oh, it's all well me, you know. Google, you're stealing, okay, people's health records, okay. This is just absolutely ridiculous, and the rest of the reason not address the allegations that they'll have Wall Street Journal's story, which centers around the fact that patent data is being collected by Google without the knowledge, okay. It's about the consent, and I think this would be, you know, and of course, you know, Google is, you know, <laughs> stealing people's data without their consent, okay? It's different, you know, with like Facebook people complain, oh, Facebook is stealing my data, even though it's a consent, even though when, it, as you say, Facebook will sell data to help create ads, yes, you're out clicking yes, which means you're out actually selling it with your consent. So those people who are basically actually like conspiracy theories about, you know, Facebook and stuff, okay, those people are like, you're, but, and, and, and then the people like consent to be, you know, send it there, but Google's just, you know, stealing, you know, data from, you know, um, you know. So this is all red, this is not true or fake, but if this is true, Google's in, a, in even more hot trouble and hot water. But, you know, they're, they're protected by the government, they're not gonna, you know, and of course operates across 21 states, which, you know, I won't be surprised if, you know, states across the countries, um, so Google is, and of course the Wall Street Journal, I can't feel the Wall Street Journal article, because, you know, you have to pay for the Wall Street Journal, okay, so that's basically that Google is spying, uh, you know, people in hospitals, it's just pretty creepy and pretty weird, okay, that's basically it, goodbye.